Today we're talking about Squarespace email campaigns versus ConvertKit. Now, before we get into uh, some of the pros and cons of both of these email marketing uh, platforms or tools, I think it's important to uh, discuss real quickly how they came to be, um, because that kind of gives you an idea of the trajectory and, and kind of where the strengths and weaknesses uh, in each platform lie. So uh, Squarespace's email marketing uh, campaigns came about a few years ago um, as an extension of their primary core offering, which was a website builder. And so the the strengths of their email marketing tool uh, is similar to the strengths of the website builder. Um, it's, it's great for uh, clean, simple designs that uh, you can, you know, make stuff that looks good and attractive um, pretty quickly. Um, so if you're if you're comfortable with, you know, creating a site on Squarespace, then creating emails with their email marketing tool is a similar experience. Now, because this is not their their primary core offering, uh, you don't get as much um, uh, flexibility with the tool. Um, as in it's not as, as feature rich as ConvertKit. Now ConvertKit started out as a specifically email marketing tool for bloggers, um, who were, uh, selling using email. So maybe they're making like a email course or things like that and needed email automation, um, to help convert visitors into buyers and that type of thing. So ConvertKit was rooted in that and it's since grown into a platform that you can use to create um, even digital products. You can uh, create landing pages and, but it, but its strength is in its email marketing tool. And so uh, w figuring out which one is best for your business, uh, there's a couple of things you might want to factor in. Uh, one of those things might be pricing. You might be thinking, okay, well, which which one is going to be mo more cost effective? Um, and uh, ConvertKit has a free plan up to 300 subscribers, and then uh, two two additional plans that give you some more features, so uh, uh, automated funnels and sequences, uh, newsletter referral system. Um, and the way it works is there's a slide in, there's a slide in scale. So the more, here we go, the more subscribers you have, well, then the more, the more you pay, right? So at the lower level, if you have no subscribers and you're just starting out, you don't have to pay anything. Um, but once you start to grow, uh, then, then the price grows with you. So let's say you get to 10,000 email subscribers and you're on the creator plan. That's a hundred dollars a month. And, um, you know, with 10,000 email subscribers, I'm sure you'll, you're getting a good ROI on that. Now on the, the Squarespace email campaign side, uh, the pricing starts, at, there is no free plan. However, every plan has unlimited subscribers. The limits come in the amount of campaigns you can send per month, right? Three, five, 20, um, and the amount of emails that you can send per month. So um, I'm not exactly sure what emails per, like how emails per month interacts with unlimited subscribers. Like let's say you have, you know, 10,000 subscribers and you want to email all 10,000 of them. I'm guessing you'll only be limited to sending it to 500. Um so I'm not sure how that, that works. However, it's all here. You can check it out. Um, and you can obviously pay annually or monthly. Um, and it, there's not a, 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 a huge, uh, feature list here. Uh, you pretty much get the same thing with, with all of the plans. Um, and so I think the the benefit of Squarespace's email campaigns again is the design aspect. If you have a really simple site and you have simple uh, email marketing needs, maybe you're sending one or two emails a month, uh, or or one email a week, and maybe you want to just take your blog post 
and convert that into an email. Uh, you can do that very easily with uh, this. And maybe you're selling products on Squarespace. Um, it's already integrated, so you can, you know, you have a little bit more flexibility on that side. Now, let's say you want to create a bunch of different automations and um, uh, funnels and sequences and uh, get more you know complex and how you set set your 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 stuff up you can use convertkit for that um you can also keep it really simple with convertkit the uh, a hidden benefit of why i i'm a big fan when it comes to using it with squarespace is it integrates with the squarespace commerce platform as well so your customers can buy products in your squarespace store and then in convertkit you can see you know you can you can tag or you don't even have to tag them they're already tagged based off of what they purchased and you can set up specific product you can set up product specific email responses right so um very useful in that regard um i think the best thing to do this is what i do and it, it sometimes gets me in trouble but just try it right you can get started for free um, you can also try Squarespace email marketing uh, campaigns, I think, for, I think uh, maybe there's like a, a free period, maybe, maybe there's like a, some, some you could try. Uh, okay, you can send up to three trial blast campaigns. There you go. All right, so I'll put a link below to both and you can... Uh, check those out if you have any questions or want me to go deeper into some specific just let me know peace